Hello and welcome to my 42nd video. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Rotel RCD 855 uh, CD player. Um, came out in the very late 80s. Um, one of the earlier compact disc players that uh, Rotel put out and it has in it which makes it very desirable even by today's standards is the uh, 1541 um, DAC that uh, everybody remembers fondly if you've uh, been around that long and have had CD players that are that old. Um, it is a uh, DAC that is built, built in and it was uh, produced by Philips and they made a chip that uh, sounded like none other that were out there at the time. It was a uh, chip that uh, gave a real full realism and almost live quality to any CD you, you uh, listen to. <clears throat> Whether it be mono or stereo in nature. <clears throat> that being said, um, I don't know why they ever stopped making them. Um, they sounded great. Um, I've put a, a lot of different CDs through here over the years and um, it gives a almost surround quality to the music even if it's in two channel. Um, live CDs sound even livelier and uh, I really like it a lot. Um, I kind of mentioned it on my last video when I was reviewing the uh, receiver that's below it and uh, as you can see they are two different styles. One is uh, the older style, one is the newer style with the kind of rack handles that are on here so they don't exactly match but in the configuration I have them right now they don't look too bad together. Um, they have a du the the uh, CD player has a dual digital audio converter in it and it has basically the, the look and feel of an 80s CD player. Um, they were uh, pretty newer technology at the time so that uh, they didn't have all those bells and whistles that they later put on things. But this one has your standard open and close, play, stop, pause, and then your track advance or reverse, plus a uh, advance and reverse for uh, searching with an A track, um, scan, shuffle, program, and repeat. As well as a, as the power button and the uh, eye for the uh, remote control. Um, this particular uh, CD player isn't supported by the uh, uh, remote that I have for current configuration for my uh, 1055 receiver and CD player. Um, I'm sure I could change it if I wanted to to. Uh, be able to control the CD player but in this setup I'm going basically with it both 1055s and that's what the, the uh, remote is set up for so I can play the CD player uh, through the remote. Uh, on the back it has your standard um, RCA jacks for the uh, left and right channels Plus it also has a, uh, a digital coaxial um, in out, output for uh, a RCA type jack. The uh, power cord on this particular model is built right into the uh, unit whereas uh, in, in uh, newer times they uh, went with the computer style heavy duty um, plug-in uh, uh, power cord which is uh, all in, all in uh, making their stuff a little bit beefier and better than some of the standard stuff you see out there. The uh, This part is plastic 
but this part here is uh, brushed aluminum and uh, I don't know if you can tell the difference but I, I can tell the difference here you can see how shiny this is compared to this and that's just because the uh, lights reflecting off the uh, aluminum I will uh, turn this on briefly just to let you see that it is in fact working still and it works really good um, sorry I won't be able to play too much of it just to uh, uh, so I don't get a copyright strike against me but uh, I will play just a brief interlude on here so that you can see that it does play and uh, I know the quality of music and and voice and stuff on YouTube isn't as good as it is right here in my room but hopefully you can uh, be able to tell a little bit of a difference between this and your standard CD player so without further ado I will turn this on here and we will sample a little bit of this uh, CD track This is about a 60 year old song that's being played in mono. Um, it does have a more spacey, airy type of uh, sound to it, and uh, it makes it much more enjoyable to listen to. So, that is uh, a track in mono. I will see if I can find a stereo track here for you to play to see uh, what it sounds like. So bear with me a minute here. And I will switch out CDs. This, this by the way, is a single disc player, unlike the 1055 CD player I have that I uh, reviewed in my previous video that uh, it was a five CD changer so I'm going to play this one here and see see what uh, it sounds like get the idea um, like I say I really like the CD player um, maybe one of these days I'll get a Rotel um, stereo that is from the same era so that I have a matching pair of those um, so that the styles don't clash but that's something that's way off in the future I don't really need one um, so anyways um, that's my short introduction to the world of older Rotel CD players and um, all their CD players are exceptional um, they're made very well they're made with uh, a lot of components inside that are of higher quality and it shows in in the uh, playing of the music and in the durability of their players so um, if you happen to find a Rotel CD player of any kind, I wouldn't hesitate to buy one. I, like I say, I've got a couple myself and they are very durable, very good. And uh, you won't be, won't be uh, upset with the purchase you made. Until next time, please like this video please subscribe to my video and please feel free to leave any comments or questions that you may have about this video 
or any of my other videos that you've seen that I've done. And until next time, be safe, have a great day, and I'll talk to you in my next video. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.